Hello everyone! In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to connect Shopify to Payoneer. So Payoneer is one of the payment gateway that you can use to accept payment and you can add Payoneer as one of the payment method on your Shopify account. It's a pretty tricky thing to connect your Payoneer to Shopify, so make sure to watch this video until the end for you to know how to connect those two accounts. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to log in into your Shopify account, and then on the left side of your screen, you're going to see the setting option at the very bottom of it, and then you're going to want to click on payment once this page show up. And then you're going to want to click on choose a provider. And if you're wondering why are we choosing a third party provider instead of adding a new payment method, it's because sometimes when you try to search for Payoneer on the add payment method sections, you're not going to be able to find it. So what you're going to do is you're going to change the search method from by payment method to by provider. And on the search bar, you can go ahead and type out Payoneer. As you can see, Payoneer Checkout is going to show. And what you're going to do is you're going to click on it. And you're going to be able to see the transactions fee for Payoneer Checkout, as well as the cards that Payoneer Checkouts are going to accept. And once you click on the Payoneer Checkout, you're going to see a brief explanation of what Payoneer Checkout is. So it says here that Payoneer Checkout makes it easy for a customer to purchase everywhere in the world through fast, easy, and secure buying experiences that build loyalty, etc, etc. You can pause the video if you would like to read more about that. But I'm just going to go ahead and click on Install. Next, Shopify is going to notify you about what the Payoneer Checkout are going to be able to access. And Payoneer are going to ask for you to permit them to access your personal data such as phone number, store name, email address, physical address, etc. And if you're fine with it, go ahead and click on install. Now, Payoneer Checkout is actually already installed if you found this page right here, but you're not going to be able to use it as your payment checkout. If you haven't managed the Payoneer account that you're going to use with this Shopify account. So what you're going to need to do next is you will have to click on the manage account button. And after that, you're going to be redirected into this Payoneer page. And if you're going to start creating a new account, if you haven't have your own Payoneer account, this is the first page that you're going to see if you choose to create a new account. They're going to ask you about your business and you can choose from the available category and then you're going to choose on the income that you will receive monthly. That says that I receive less than $5,000 a month and then they're going to tell you that you can actually get paid by e-commerce marketplace which is what we're trying to do right here. As you can see Shopify is one of the marketplace that can be used with Payoneer and what you're going to do next is click on the register button. And over here, you're going to fill in the other details like you can select the type of business, whether it's individual or a company, and then you're going to fill in your name, your last name, email address, etc. Now, there is actually a second way for you to connect your Shopify with Payoneer. And the second way to do that is by login into your Payoneer account. And then you're going to click on the get paid option on the left side of your screen. And you're going to choose on the receiving account. Over here, you can request on the account you can use if you want to receive some money. And right here, I already have an account that allows me to receive payment from USA and you can request more account if you need to and I'm going to show you that later but for now I'm going to show you that if you already have a receiving account you're going to want to try and see the detail of your account and as you can see you're going to be able to see the account guideline for your receiving account and this particular account are going to allow me to use 
the local bank transfer within us and usd and the only payment that it's going to receive is for business transactions and business accounts are supported payment for personal bank account will be declined payment made from a bank account in my name will be declined and international wire transfer are not supported and it also says that transfer usually take one to three business days and if you scroll all the way down, you're going to find that besides beneficiary name, there's going to be a connecting to a marketplace option. What it does is that it's going to show what is going to happen if I'm trying to connect the account to a marketplace, which in our case is going to be Shopify. It says that to avoid a declined payment, I need to tell my payer to use the beneficiary name exactly as it's appeared above this notification box when they're trying to make a bank transfer. So basically, that additional explanation just says that this particular account that I have right now are not suitable to be connected to a marketplace. And if you would like to create a new receiving account, all you have to do is just click on the request the account and over here you're going to see a selections of country that you can receive your money from you can choose more than just one country if you need to and then you're going to click on submit request once you're done with your request and one thing i will need to tell you is that if you want to connect your pioneer to your Shopify account from the Pioneer account, you're going to want to have a business account instead of an individual account like the one that I have here because it's going to make the risk of the payments to be rejected higher. So I strongly advise you to create a business account on Pioneer before you connect it to your Shopify. Another way for you to add Payoneer as your payment method on Shopify is by going back to the Shopify account and then click on Payments and scroll all the way down and you're going to find a manual payment method options. Over here, what you're going to do is you're going to want to create a custom payment method and you're going to fill in the details from here. Start from the custom payment method name. I'm going to name it Payoneer because that's what we're going to use. And then you're going to want to insert additional details. And in this additional detail sections, you can insert the email that you're using for Pioneer. And you can just insert your Pioneer email. I'm just going to use an example. So it's pioneer at email.com. And for the payment instructions, and as for the payment instructions text box, I advise you to add instructions as clearly as possible so that when people are trying to pay you manually with Payoneer, they will not make any mistakes. For example, you want them to make sure to insert the correct emails when you're, they're trying to wire you the money, or you also want them to keep a screenshot of their transactions. And then after they done with their payment, maybe you will want to send them email to confirm their orders and to reply the confirmation email, they will have to reply it with the screenshot of their transaction so that you will know that they already made their payment. Feel free to add up the payment instructions as much as you want. The one that I've inserted right here are just some examples. So make sure to put your payment instruction as clear as possible. So you're going to minimize any mistakes in regards of payment. And those are some of the things that you can do if you want to connect your Shopify account to your Payoneer account. Out of all of the method that I've shown you, I personally prefer the first method which is where you're going to connect your Payoneer to Shopify by clicking on the payment sections on Shopify and then try to find for the Payoneer checkout. I personally think that that is the easiest as well as the safest method to connect your Shopify with your Payoneer. But feel free to try out the other methods if you feel like, let's say, the Manual method is easier for you, feel free to do that. But once again, I'm going to remind you to be very careful when you're adding your payment instructions. 
and make sure to create your instruction as clear as possible. So that is how you can connect your Shopify to your Payoneer account. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.